Hey guys, welcome back to Marketing Fundas Global. In this video, we are going to show you how to add a pixel code into your website or you can say how to set up a pixel code into your website. Well guys, pixel code is a pretty important tool which help you uh, helps you to track everything in your Facebook ad campaign. So if you want to track, if you want to remarket, if you want to sell your product to your previous audience, then you have to add a pixel code into your website. So let's just understand how we can add or how we can set up this code into our website. So let's get into the video without any further ado. So guys, as you can see right now, I'm in my Facebook ad account and now I'm going to show you how you can add your uh, first you have to create your pixel code then you have to add that code into your website whether you are using it on wordpress whether you are using a custom coded website or you are using on a shopify you have to paste that code into your website in order to track everything right so first let's just understand a bit that what is this uh, pixel what is this pixel code it is basically a two or three lines of code that helps you or you can say that connects your website with the facebook ad campaign from which you are running your ads right and when it uh, these two platforms connected you get the all pre uh, precious data or you can say all the important data which you need to track and by which you can remarket your to your audience or even you can create a look-alike audience like your previous audience then if you want to sell your product or service to your previous audience you can do that as well right because you have the data you have those precious details that uh, whom you have shown your ads earlier right but if there is no any pixel code then you will not be able to access this data right so now let me go to this all tools icon and when i click here here in manage business option you'll be able to see this event manager option you have to click on this once you redirect here in the event manager overview uh, section here you will be able to see connect data option click on this now it is asking that which type of property you have where you want to connect your or where you want to add your pixel code right so right now we do have our website otherwise you can use your application or other platforms as well but we are going with the website right now now click on connect and here you have to add a pixel name uh, you have to name your pixel code right so i'm adding demo pixel right now click on create pixel now here you have to add the url of your website so let me click go to the website copy the url and go to the events manager and paste it here uh, now once you paste the code here it will check your website that whether it is uh, compatible or whether it is suitable for the code or not right so click on this and yeah it is el eligible right now hit the next button now here it is asking you have two options that conversion api and metapixel right and we have the second option which is metapixel only so if you want to track conversion uh, basically you want to add the conversion api and metapixel both the things into your website then you should use these this option otherwise you can if let's say you just want to track your website's activity then metapixel code is uh, the thing all you need right so click on this right now i'm going with this one although it is recommended but it is totally up to you i am just showing you otherwise you can use this option as well there is no any issue right the pro process is same i'm going with the, this one right now metapixel only click on this now let me refresh it once it is loading again and here it is created now click on this demo pixel the name of my pixel which i have uh, added right now you have to click on continue pixel setup click on this now you have two options the first one is install code manually or check your partners so we want to install code manually click on this and now you will get a code which you have to paste it into your website so just copy the code and make sure you are uh, pasting this code into the head section of your website right where the head head opens and where the head closes you have to enter this code between those two tags right now i have also already uh, i have already copied the text now let me go to the website now this is the wordpress website which i'm using but the process is same you just have to paste the code into the head section of your website if you are using shopify then it will be pretty easier you can watch any video that how to uh, add a code into pixel code into my shopify dashboard otherwise if you are using custom coded website then you have to take help of your programmer right from whom you have uh, created the website now go to appearance and in editor 
so that I can access theme editor or site editor you can say oh let me go back this is not uh, actually I haven't uh, added any theme into this website that's why uh, I'm not able to add or I'm not able to access any theme editor because we have to paste the code into the theme editors head section right but we don't have any theme editor option here so let me just add one theme and then I'll uh, add the pixel code okay so let's say I'm adding this Astra pretty popular one let me activate it and once it's activated you'll be able to see this option theme file editor click on this and here you have to go to header.php this one once you click on header.php here you'll be able to see this is the opening of head section and here's the closing of head section right now you have to paste your code between these two codes right between these two codes right just create one line and paste the code here like this right the code has been pasted now just scroll a little bit down and update the file and boom the pixel code has been added into your website now if I go to my event manager and hit the continue and if you want you can turn this option on so that you can track all these things as well then hit the continue button and again continue if you want you can verify your domain as well otherwise continue and go to pixel overview now here you will be able to see data once your uh, pixel gets detected and your website starts getting traffic right now if I refresh it the interface might get changed a little bit because I have added already already added the pixel code no the now let me show you how you can check that whether the pixel code is properly added into your website or not because it is also important you just have to search meta pixel helper right this is the uh, chrome extension just click on this and you have to add this chrome extension into your browser add to chrome add extension once it's added yeah it's added now now let me pin this extension here this is the extension yeah the extension has been pinned now now let me access the site just copy this and paste it here right i have pasted this is the website right now now if i click on this you'll be able to see this is the pixel code that has been detected right if you want you can uh, check out or you can cross check the pixel code as well it is starting with 95875 and if i go back to my event manager and click on here here you'll be able to see the pixel id 95875 yeah this is the same and once I refresh it, it will start showing the data as well. Click on get started because I have visited the site. That's why it is showing. Let me go back, right? So this is the dashboard. You will be uh, able to see when your website starts getting traffic, right? All the activity will be tracked here. So I hope you understood how to add or how to set up a pixel code into your website so that you can tr track each and every thing, every important data. And if you still have any question or query, please comment down below. I'll answer those questions in the comment section itself. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe the channel. I'll meet you in the next video. Till then, bye-bye.